Hi, hello guys, welcome to my channel. I am Bina Unnikrishnan and I am a veterinarian. And today's video is to clarify the difference between Master of Veterinary Science in Clinical Subject in India and in Canada. So in India, those who wish to pursue their career as a clinician will continue their education by taking up Master of Veterinary Science in a clinical subject like surgery, OG gynecology or uh, clinical medicine and you will be attending the clinics alongside your research work but this is not the case in Canada so if you want to become a specialized clinician in Canada you would have to take internship and residency program after completing the internship and residency program you can apply for board certification and if you meet the requirements of the board certification you will be a board certified clinician specialized in that area and I'll be doing a detailed video about board certification. When it comes to masters in Canada, it is solely research based. You will be doing your entire research in a laboratory setup learning laboratory techniques. And if your research involves handling animals, you will be given training or asked to take courses related to that. And after completing this certification of courses, you will be uh, allowed to work with animals and that too were only doing that specified technique or in that specified animal. I'll give you my example. My honors was Master of Science in Veterinary Medical Sciences from University of Calgary, Canada. And I was basically doing research in bovine sperm. And it was andrology work. So if I was doing this research work in India, I would have been doing masters in a clinical subject which is obstetric gynecology, OG. So that's the case. I hope you have understood the difference. So I would like you to know one more thing. So if uh, an undergraduate student who have completed their studies in zoology or biology and they ha if they have a major in mammalian reproduction, they could have applied for my same position. And if the supervisor is willing to accept that student, that student might have done the masters in the same subject. So you should always keep that in mind too. It's actually the research interest that matters when it comes to masters in Canada and also obviously PhD as well. So hope uh, the career path to a clinician, specialized clinician in Canada is clear for you all. So please support my channel by subscribing it and also please click the bell icon for getting the updates. Thank you. Bye.